Gordon, please teach me to scrambled egg. Breakfast. Never get a chance to eat it Monday to Friday, but Saturday, Sunday, however. Wait, what? <laughs> I feel like there was probably a whole bunch of information I need to know in there, but you just glossed over it with a beautiful accent. Hold on. Breakfast. Never get a chance to eat it Monday to Friday, but Saturday, Sunday, however, is the time when... What? <laughs> okay. I'm just gonna go get the eggs. You... Uh, keep talking? I, I don't know. Flat cap mushrooms, just keep them. Wait, what about mushrooms? Okay, what did I what did I miss? How did I miss half the meal? What are you doing with the mushrooms? Mushrooms? Big breakfast, scrambled egg, sauteed mushrooms. Okay, I can't understand a word you're saying, Gordon. I'm gonna have to go off body language. Does this mean pan? Hold on, pan. I has this pan. That'll do, pig? Okay. The most important thing about any scrambled egg is stopping from overcooking. I tend to have trouble with that step. And since that's the only step, I'll probably go to McDonald's. Oil, you said? What are you saying? Like, the words coming out of your mouth are not entering my ears at the same rate that you're speaking of. Flat cap mushrooms, just keep them whole and put them in the pan. Keep the mushrooms whole, okay. What if that's not an option? How much oil? Okay, it's not hot, but you're rushing me, so. Pam, no sizzle, no need. <laughs> I'm not gonna eat them anyway. I don't like mushrooms. What kind of tomato, vine tomatoes? I don't know what social media these are. What do I keep them on the vine? Okay. <laughs> Consider them kept upon the vine. Oh wait, you salted your mushrooms. So much is happening. Gordon. Say when. Now you don't want to talk, do you? Okay. Why am I peppering it? I'm not gonna eat the mushrooms. Sit there in the pan on a low heat and they'll cook themselves. Low heat, so um, not nine. This here is is a gigantic stale piece of bread. Will you calm down? I'm trying to talk. That's a loaf of moldy bread. I don't have, I might have that. You know what, Gordon, sometimes I amaze myself. I do have a moldy piece of bread. What did you do with yours? Hold on, let me get a cutting board. You're going at the speed of taste. Where are the eggs? Why are we not cooking eggs right now? I thought this was the perfect scrambled egg. You know what, I'm not gonna question you, Gordon. Into the toaster. Into the toaster. Gordon, my bread don't fit in the toaster. I cut it too thick. Gordon, what am I going to do with that? Get, get in there. Okay, now what? Sorry, Gordon, my hands are real buttery. I don't know why I haven't touched butter yet. I'm assuming digging bread out of a toaster with a fork's probably not the best idea. I'm just kidding. Fourth time's the charm cutting my bread. Here we go. Thin slice, Brandon. Your toaster can only handle so much. Okay, into the toaster. Well, now it's too long. Oh, I didn't take it. Hold on. Cancel. Oh, I'm not going to be able to pull it out. It's... Oh, dear Jesus. Ow. Okay. Hi. We're not having bread, Gordon. Okay. Not today. Start off with three eggs. Three? You're a hungry, hungry hippo, Gordon. <laughs> Hold on. Let me get a pan. What? What actually happens? It breaks down the eggs. Why is your eggs in a pot? Eggs don't go in pots, said the guy who has two pieces of moldy bread stuck in his toaster. I'll trust you this time, okay? Scrambled eggs in a pot. Unseasoned. These are burnt to the dickens. Do I flip them or just let them... Die. They're dead. Put the butter in right at the very beginning. Put the butter in. Okay, no amounts here. Not with Gordon. You've seen what happens when I guess, right? You remember the toaster thing? Yeah. How much butter? And then a simple spatula. Simple? All I have is extra. I wasn't kidding, Gordon. You gotta break it down in the pan. They broke when I opened them. <laughs> My mushrooms have shriveled up to maybe a quarter of their original size. May I take them out? Treat it like a risotto. How do you treat a risotto? Ro risotto. What's a risotto? That's a lot of butter, Gordon. On the heat, off the heat, on the heat, off the heat. Okay, gotcha. My butter is still ever, ever present, Gordon. Back onto the heat. Oh, okay. Now if I had off the heat. Got it. Doesn't need to go back on the stove. Ever? Because it's actually half a tablespoon of creme fraiche. The heck is creme fraiche? Creme fraiche. I have mayo. I have cream cheese that hasn't been opened. It's very fresh. You can say goodbye to the mushrooms, okay? They are beyond gone. Does the spoon full have to go in there because it's not? There it goes. A little bit of salt. And then it's a little bit of, just to finish that, I'm just gonna put a That's little a lot of salt. in there. Go on. That, if you wanna be a good boy, run upstairs now and give it to her in bed for breakfast. I don't have an upstairs, Gordon. <laughs> or a girlfriend, here. The creme fraiche and butter are both not melted. Perfect, let's try it. What do I eat? I don't know, it's soup. Gordon, on a plate. That was a lot of salt. I knew it was. 